Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why would they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific, a crackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. This is the lineup we've been given. How do you read it, Jim? Well, the obvious standout in today's football in this system is that it provides you with extra presence in attack. With many shaky defences about, getting the right partnership in that department can pay rich dividends as long as there's a good early supply. So playing two strikers can, um, can be a real help to this team. I mean, 4-4-2 these days, Peter, gets a lot of criticism, but it's, it's unfair. Any system can work if you've got the right players. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. What a throw in. for the cross massively <laughs> tries to get it forward quickly neither side yet able to find the net Let's the ball in. Hoists it forward. And he certainly caught him there. It's a free kick. And it's played forward. got through and the ball is out of play forward it goes the goal now would certainly liven things up That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. And he's there to clear it. Plays it out to the flank. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Defense has got rid of that. And the half-time whistle goes. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Reflections on the first half. Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. So they head in no further forward. The score here, still nil-nil. Already up and running for the second half. 
at least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Oh, half-time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. It's always a good time to register and, and lay down a, an early marker in the second half. They clearly had exactly that in mind and have gone about their business with absolutely the right commitment. Out towards the flank, here it comes. Well, that's where he wants it. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run, he just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. That intervention was very necessary. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him. Shot a goal! That's a half-decent try. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Intercepted, really alert to the danger. And helps available out wide. Here comes the corner. And that has been cleared. Can he deliver? Header! Oh, and that should have been two. He got two ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. It's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. A real chance to break. More than happy to take the muscular approach. And that's that. Terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal in it. But that was enough. Well, this game looked to have near nil written all over it. But credit to them. They upped their game in the end. And I thought they got what they deserved.